Greetings, cyber dogs and citizens of the inner bubs. It is Ren Diggity Dog coming at you for another Minecraft episode here on the Hermitcraft server. We are plunk right down here in Aqua Town where the diamonds flow when we walk the streets with our crown to let people know that we are PvP slash hardcore parkour champions and in our last episode here in aqua town we were truly cooking with gas here when we built this massive skyscraper with all sorts of beautiful little details like our radio antenna our water tower and all these are the things that make buildings truly come to life but to take it to the next level here we are going to well finally build the interior where hermits can come and get themselves some free stuff that is right this is the interior or will be the interior of free where hermits can come if they are clients of good times realty and get free resources to jumpstart their next build here in aqua town and well <laughs> you might be wondering why are you wearing red skin because we raised over 100,000 pounds or 150,000 plus dollars to SOS Africa on a live stream to support people in need. And if we got to the very top, we, well, <laughs> had to swap skins with each other and it was well, well worth it. And there are a lot of people that are going to be helped by your absolute wonderful generosity that brought this total all the way to the top where we have to skin swap. <laughs> but uh, yeah, if you want to learn more, there is more information on my Twitch channel when we did the live stream and on my Twitter. But just at this very first tier at 15,000, we were able to make a catering kitchen and provide a thousand meals a week to people in need. And that goes all the way up to education and then supporting people in troubled situations absolutely wonderful i thank you guys so much for all the support for donating or just showing up to stream hanging out in the chat or sharing the link that made this possible you made this possible and we thank you so much and can we just say before we head out of the valley of Taturen, say that this base is absolutely breathtakingly amazing and can we just get some support for ren for this because he built like almost all of this overnight in the valley section with the you know the cantina the towers and all that stuff it was wonderful to see this come to life and he put his heart and soul into this and it's just absolutely fantastic and as a star wars uh, super nerd like i don't know this brings me so much joy to see darth vader's tower jabba's palace and all of the other little details here so yeah make sure you go and check out ren as he built this thing because it's amazing look at that absolutely beautiful skyline that makes up aqua town and i've actually been tinkering around with some new buildings that will truly transform the skyline here in aqua town and i'm really Really excited for you ouch to see them but they need just a little bit more tinkering around with to make them absolutely perfect but we are here in front of green's massive barge hq which i've got to say <laughs> <laughs> this thing is really clever. It really is like an elongated barge. I think it's super clever. Anyway, heading on inside here. This is his game that he's been working on for quite some time and I've been very excited to uh, play it. So what do we got here? Hermitcraft to the HCBB. Wait. No, welcome, not Hermitcraft. Welcome to the HCBBS. Hermitcraft Big Bard Sweep. Wow, that's exciting. The game is explained when you play. Play 16 diamonds in the chest below and grab a minecart. Then read the technical signs on the right. Well, I, I generally don't read technical signs nor instructions, but I feel like for this, we probably should. So 16 diamonds go here, minecarts in that box. And what is this? Place your minecart and enter it. Play the disc and enjoy. Okay, okay, where's the tech signs here? Let's see, tech list, rebound crutch. To not, wait, crunch? Crouch, not crunch. <laughs> Oh, okay. All right. That, that was that was rather funny. Rebound, not crunch. Okay. I think crouch forever will be crunch now. To not shift, apply RP. RP, RP. I assume that's not reputation points from third life. That must be resource back. Okay. So we will rebound crunch and then uh, we'll take care of that for whatever reason. I don't know why. I checked Discord for more information on audio. Place minecart here. If block is up, then disc is still in the jukebox. Okay, well, 
we're going to come back here in a little bit and do this. This is going to be really, really fun. I've been looking forward to this for quite some time. But before we do that, we've got some other business to take care of. Like the fact that our establishment here, Good Times Realty, has been vandalized. And we're going to have to clean this up. Either it was vandalized or I'm just really negligent when it comes to maintaining my manicured lawns and flowers. But on the other hand, I did pay the Jelly Landscaping Service to come through here, and she did not. She did not at all. Also, the fact is that we have a giant pigsty in each one of our plots. And that has a tremendous amount of poop. And I'm not going to clean up that poop, as that's not my poop. There is a man here on this server that's going to clean up this poop, and he is responsible for it right what in the world oh no 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 oh my gosh oh no oh no <laughs> we've got we've got a really small pile of diamonds that's a massive pile oh no we're getting torched in the uh land games oh wow captain boomer gray hair over here is really coming out with the diamonds okay all right do you think it was because how trashy the front of my building looks without its flowers and manicured lawns and the poop everywhere? Also gonna have free stuff. Also, I'm not used to looking at Ren's face so much. Figured out how B-dubs accumulated so many diamonds and it looks like winter green on every plot. Winter green, winter green, winter green, winter grain, winter Brian. Oh, XB entered the chat. <laughs> I was so convinced that this one was going to be green. So XP has one of the plots. Okay, so every one of these, but that one is green. So he's got some kind of land grab planned. And you know what? I kind of love it. I'm excited to see what he has in store with that. And uh, yeah, Hermit's out there. Um, hello. <laughs> it's uh, Ren Diggity Dog Scar here. I, I, I'll let you pet Jelly. And I've got free stuff coming if you... Purchase my land, it would, it would mean a lot. You know how family photos are always awkward where everybody squeezes in to try to get in the frame for a photo? Well, that's what I want to see done here at Mount Scar, which is now Mount Hermit. I want to see all the hermit's heads on this mountain, all squeezing in to stay in frame. We've got B-dubs down below. We've got a cub. We have jelly. We have my head. And I want all the rest of the hermits to figure out a way to squeeze in here and make a super awkward family photo. So let the hermits know that they need to put a head on this mountain please. There we go. Good Times Realty is back in business. And if Fire Tick was on right now, <laughs> something wouldn't be haunting me anymore in my life. It would be gone in ashes, some would say. But anyway, so we've got work to do today. So let's pop out of the pewter pan window and head over to free. Still not 100% sure what the name of this building is going to be, but free still sticks around a little bit longer. So what we're going to do here is we are going to build this into a old fashioned hardware store, a place where you can go. It's kind of a mom and pop shop where, you know, they've got kind of a bucket of nails. That's all they have. Just one kind. They've got some tools up on the walls, some, you know, some paint here and there. Lots of signage everywhere where it just says tools, paint more tools and wood. <laughs> so yeah, I've been looking at a lot of old fashioned uh, hardware stores, you know, not the big box stores like Home Depot or Lowe's, but you know, like old, old fashioned ones. And uh, yeah, I think we're gonna have a lot of fun with this. And my goal with the general structure of it is to keep it fairly neutral and then let the details in terms of the products shine. So I'll show you more about that when we get to it. The second level here is going to be where all the free stuff is. And then up there, I'm not 100% sure, I'll be honest with you. We'll figure out when we get there, but uh, yeah. So why don't we uh, jump into super fast build mode and well, build up the interior of free.
super fast build mode and we've got a bit of tragedy here in aqua town in that that time lapse was cut a little bit short because we lost everything all of the resources that i was using to build the shop and that's all the details all the banners and everything all the dark oak all the spruce and of course the birch all was destroyed by a creeper and not just one creeper but two the first creeper wiped out the chest the shulker boxes everything was on the ground and then the second one tag teamed in and wiped it out just completely deleted it all the creepers are on to us now <laughs> they're getting smarter so thankfully i remembered we've got some other resources that I forgot about. And that's here in Grian's barge, part of one of his barge quests. B-Dubs and I won all of this stuff. So luckily there was some wood in here and a bunch of other resources that I was able to finish the interior, except for all the small details like the banners and everything that I put together. So we're still going to have to recraft all of those. So give me one minute and let me finish up the store. Finally got all of the interior details rebuilt and assembled. And I realized there was one banner set that I forgot to recreate. And that, of course, is the marquee that's supposed to go on the side of the building. Rip that. We will get to it. But I am super happy with this interior. And it really does feel like a big city, small hardware store just brimming with detail and overflowing shelves on every corner. So we got the tool racks in front of us here. We, of course, got our ladders on the back wall with our tools banner. And then on the other side here, we got paint. That's right. We got paint canisters all along this wall. So using the micro blocks here for paint cans and things along those lines so on this shelving unit we've got all sorts of different kinds of stone of all varieties back here we got little mine carts and lots of high shelves and of course got some pistons and just lots of miscellaneous things and on this shelf we got all sorts of wood so you got your standard wood and you got your logs on this side behind the counter of course that is where you know that's where the most expensive things are usually behind so we've got netherite tools glistening behind the cashier and yeah i am super super happy with this by the way we got some bigger tools down at the bottom but the main purpose of this building, of course, lies up in the upper level here. Taking the elevator, we now arrive at the... I thought I had a sign here. I did have a sign. I wonder if I broke it by mistake. I There was a sign right here. I swear there was a sign. Anyway, it said this area is for good times, reality clients only. All resources are free. Take as much as you want. I don't think you can fit all that on a sign. I may have been dreaming. It is late. I had to redo a lot of stuff, so it's very late. Um, so each one of these boxes here is just it's just brimming full of resources. So hopefully this is, you know, concrete materials to get people going over here. All the different types of stone we have on this side. We've got quartz and shulker boxes if they need them. All sorts of dyes, glass over here, quartz and then terracotta all along this back section. There's just terracotta galore and then stone and yeah even more stuff on the back side there and this is for of course as i said a million times this is for good times clients to come up here get a jump start on their builds with all of these free resources and i had an absolute blast other than losing everything to those creepers building out this interior it was so much fun just to kind of look at some research in terms of pictures of old kind of hardware stores in big cities and the takeaway was lots of signs like our paint and tool signs and then just high shelves just brimming with stuff and uh yeah hopefully you guys like this and were inspired for your own kind of big city uh hardware store here and uh yeah even to stacked up a bunch of stuff in the front i've been looking forward to this all day now that the interior is complete we can play the big what was it again the hermitcraft big barge sweeps oh this is gonna be amazing okay so i got 16 diamonds i dropped off all my materials in that chest so let's throw that there let's grab ourselves a minecart now i am going to bring some food just in case and oh yeah yeah, yeah. i think i think we got to pull this out 
Okay, I think this is how this works. We're gonna put this in there and we're gonna put our minecart there and then we go down. Ooh, I'm a little nervous. You know that feeling you get at the pit of your stomach when you're at the top of a hill on a roller coaster? You hear that click of the clack of the chain below you as you're about to crest the hill? Well, I am feeling that right now. Okay, I think I've got everything set. All the audio settings are good. We've got the minecart. Let's go a boom. We got that in there. And then we're gonna put that there and away we go. Welcome to Ooh, the HCBBS, the Hermitcraft Big Barge Sweep. In this game, your task is extremely simple. To open up as many shulker boxes as humanly possible and to get, uh, not that one there, that, that one's empty. You need to get as many items from the shulker boxes as po Can you, can you hear? Hello, can you? I, you, you are going a bit far away. I don't think I can hear. Hello? Oh, is this it? Are we going? Oh, we are. We're going, guys. <laughs> oh, let's grab as much stuff as we can. <laughs> oh, my gosh. This is amazing. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, my gosh. This is like, I'm feeling, I'm feeling like we're at Disneyland. This is, this is great. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, my gosh. Wow. This is awesome. <laughs> oh, man. This is, this is, this is the fix that I needed for not being able to ever go to Disneyland. Oh, oh, that's a secret. We missed it. Grab some stuff. <laughs> oh, wow. This is, oh, we got, we got a chest plate. That's amazing. <laughs> this is so intricate and like amazing. Wow. Oh, here's some stuff. Grab it, grab it, grab some stuff. Okay. I bet there's one hidden up here somewhere. Hold on. I bet there's something in here. Just click, spam click, spam click. Oh, oh. Well, hello there, poultry man. <gasps> that was a secret. I bet, yeah, I bet if you pulled that, ooh, stinky hippies. You know, you could smell them a mile away, those stinky hippies. <laughs> oh, we can grab stuff. Oh, this is good. No, no, we, we missed, we missed the other chest. <laughs> oh, wow. It's over. Oh, man, that was, I mean, that was a blast. Oh, wow. I absolutely love that. Oh man, I was just dreaming of going to Disneyland and when we were building the interior there, like legitimately, I was watching Disneyland videos, like vlogs and stuff. And uh, yeah, man, that really hit the spot. Well, I had an absolute blast and I want to do this again. So hang on to them hats and glasses because this here is the wildest ride Welcome in all of Hermitcraft. BBS. You need to get as many items from the shulker boxes as possible. Can you, can you hear me? Hello, no, you, Green, I'm going through I, a dark tunnel. You're going a bit I can't hear you. Away. Can't hear you. are going to take hate. all your resources. Hello? <laughs> okay. All right. I want to see if we can get some of these secret areas. Oh, here we go. We got stuff. All right. We did a little bit better that time. This one. Get it. Oh, we got a combo. That's it. <laughs> oh, that. Okay. That gets me every time. This is clever. I like that. Man, I want to make a roller coaster so bad right now. <laughs> oh, it's been so long. I feel like there's secrets we're missing in this section. Definitely in the dark area. Let's keep a weather eye open in here. No, no mist. Oh, no, oh, they make it so hard. <laughs> they make it so hard. All right, all right, we're gonna find some stuff here. We're gonna find some stuff. We're gonna find some stuff. This one right here. Oh, no, I had that invisibility. I actually wanted that invisibility potion. <laughs> all right, grab that. Oh, mycelium, gross. Okay, this is the money. This is the money in here. We just gotta like click. Okay, click, 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 click. Dang it. I know there's secrets in there. Like, you know, you... Oh, we missed the switch track. Ah, we'll probably have to go again if we want to get those switch tracks. See, there's another one right there. Man, I love how there's like intricate details like throughout this entire area, right? Oh, I love it. Man, I'm just so inspired right now. Ah. Oh. It's the funnest I've had on Hermitcraft in a long freaking time. That was a blast. We didn't get any crazy treasures, but the true treasure was the ride. And I can't tell you how much I enjoyed that. Like my cheeks are hurting from smiling. <laughs> but yeah, here is our treasures. And you know, the total of dying is not too bad. Um, but yeah, we got a couple cool things here. Now, of course, if Green needs extra supplies to stock this back up, I'm totally willing to help him because, well, I'm 
I, I want to go a couple more times because I think there were secret passages that we have to hit switches to go in those areas. And uh, I want to try more of those. So we will definitely help him if he needs more resources for the ride. Well, my friends, I had an absolute blast today riding Grian's resource roller coaster, building out the interior for our free shop. And I do want to mention on the back of the building here, I was inspired by a post on Reddit that showed an elevator back here. And I was trying to fit an elevator. I couldn't do it. And I didn't think just to expand out the back. So thank you for the inspiration on that. And I wanted to make sure I mentioned that before we closed out today. And uh, yeah, we have one last try here to see if we can get back on top with the diamonds here in the land games. So yeah, let the other hermits know there are free resources if they buy some land from Scar. Also put your head on Mount Hermit over there. So yeah, had a blast. I hope you did too. And until next time, this has been Good Times with Scar and I. Always really appreciate you guys taking the time to watch the videos. And if you believe the video served rating, that would be much appreciated. And until next time, we'll see you later. And don't subscribe because you may just become scarred for life.